Oh, we were busting it up. No, we had like a 20 yard scrap. Yeah, did you sucker him in? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Good morning, everybody. Heading up, uh, getting up early to go head down to the WRL race. Uh, it's my first race of the season with WRL. It's our team's third. Um, look at this. A little frost on the windshield. A little chilly already. All right, got to grab some tools, load up, and get headed to the track. One more thing. Big Lance needs a big impact wrench. Oh, need a battery for it, too. First, we gotta grab some track essentials, quest bar, charger, some sunglasses, sports rehydration drink. All right, got everything loaded. I think I'm ready to go. Short little hour and a half drive to the track. We're ready to go. Let's see, we grid out at 10 a.m. Or grid out at 9.50, and the race starts at 10 a.m. It's now 7.20. Balmy 54 degrees, and the uh, foreigners giving back a very nice 18.2. All right, we'll uh, check in a little bit later. See you guys. Lance and Wayne headed down last night with the uh, Miata and Team Stooges and got the car teched in, got all of our equipment teched in. Um, they have to check our helmets, our race suits, make sure they have uh, current fire certifications. Apparently they weren't too thrilled that I wasn't there last night, so I may be having a little bit of heat when I get there for check-in. But it should all be good. Um, anyway, looking forward to a great race. The weather's going to be fantastic. It's supposed to be low 80s, uh, some overcast. I don't know if we're going to get any rain out there or not, but looking forward to a great race. Uh, this is a 24-hour race, but we decided to, we're only going to do 9 hours of it. That's another option, is to do 9 hours. And the reason for that was... Our consumables go way, way up on a 24-hour race, and uh, there's a race in December at Circuit of the Americas in Austin that we really want to run. So, for budgetary reasons and wear and tear in the car, we decided to run nine hours here and run the 18 hours. Uh, is it 18? Yeah, 18 hours at Coda uh, in December. Can I do the uh, number one with a McCafe coffee? Just a regular coffee? Yeah. Hi. Hi there. Have a good day, thank you. Yeah, you too. Oh, I'm in. Tommy! <laughs> Dana Stig's here. <laughs> Hi, Stig. How you doing, buddy? Doing good. Good, good to see you. Nice to see you. Oh, yeah. Tommy, we're yeah. learning. Mark, fuel should stay cool, shouldn't it? Yeah, yeah, that's right. You get more laps out of the same amount of fuel. What I tell you, Bear, it's like having a teenager. You don't, you're not sure they're listening. Sometimes you have to say it three times. Keep everything. That's right. Driver included. <laughs> How's the drive down, Tommy? Oh, usual I-25. TR8. Trader 8. Trader 8. Trade. Tommy, you want to go see if it's up to temp? If it is, shut it off. So Wayne, you got first stint this morning. What do you think? I think it's going to be a good time. Yeah. A little nervous, I'm not going to lie. No, oh, I know. Me too. My first, my first rolling start. We've done this a hundred times, but you're always nervous. That's why you keep coming hey back. Hey guys, and uh, sometimes you'll need to see this part of the net. Just tuck it in so it doesn't get caught in the door. Okay. Tommy, did you see that? Yeah, yeah. The net can get...
Any thoughts before you go out? Tom, I got an hour 35 stint. It's going to be close on fuel. We should be able to do it. Uh, so the goal is to bring it home. Wayne's got us up to ninth. 16 cars. I'm uh, hoping to pick up one, maybe two spots, finish in the top half after our mishap this morning. But good run today for Stooges. Side of Lance Guyman, little post race interview. How did it go out there, Lance? It was uh, actually was fun. The sun was really tough the last 15 minutes. Coming down the big straightaway, I could not see the corner. Yeah, you're looking at the stakes, downship, and then you're just like, God, I hope it's here. And then that one where you dive the lefty, right? With the wheel and the windshield, you're just like, okay, into the fog. Were you able to keep the car on the track? Yeah. So uh, I had one, two, uh, two wheels off down in the hairpin. Uh, what, what happened with you and the black and white Miata over in turn four? Oh, we were busting it up. No, we had like a 20 yard scrap. Yeah, did you sucker him in? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Threw him <laughs> well off track. But I, you know, then, then I got tired of him and I just put a half a lap on him. And then the 944 too, he kept pestering me. Yeah. I finally just got pissed. I'm like, that's it. I'm gonna drive. And What do you think, crew chief? Ah, it's a win. <laughs> Anytime you get to check the flag, it's a win. That's right. How the car perform? As expected.